and take a deep breath in. Send your breath out through your mouth. So you're breathing in through your nose and you're breathing out through your mouth. Lengthen your breath so that you can really slow it down and feel the energy of that exhale. And then go ahead and send that lengthened exhale down through your body, through your heart, through your belly, through your feet, allowing that exhale to carry with it any stress or worries or any energy that doesn't serve you right now. Breathing in, breathing down, noticing as you breathe in and out, <coughs> excuse me, noticing as you exhale and being mindful to open your mouth when you exhale. When you do that deliberately and intentionally, noticing the heat that comes from you and out your mouth. So really pay attention to that right now. Breathing in, breathing out. Sensing the heat that is emitted from your body as you exhale. Sensing the heat in your lips and in your mouth as your breath leaves your warm body. Connecting with the fire inside of you and the fire to be found externally can begin with the breath. Your breath <clears throat> connects you to your internal fire. So go ahead and gently open up your palms and welcome in your connection with the earth. And you can do that by sending your roots down into the earth. And you can do that by connecting deeply with a place in nature that you absolutely love. Connecting in with the earth. Coming into your center. Breathing out anything that is not serving you in this moment and connecting in with the heat of your breath. With your palms open, notice the energy that it lives and moves through those palms. <clears throat> you have the power and the choice to consciously connect with the energy that flows through your hands. You can breathe it up through the earth and out through your hands and you can simply just be with what you notice. Naturally, as you breathe and bring your awareness to your hands, you'll notice a little bit of energy, maybe a lot of energy there. Take a moment to offer gratitude to your body for its internal fire being lit. Gratitude to your body for moving energy in a way that burns out what you don't need. <clears throat> and gratitude to the healing life force that moves through you. However you are, wherever you are. Whether you're happy, frustrated, sad, excited, serious all of those phases of being, all of those phases of being exist with the life force moving through you. Go ahead and come into your center and bring your awareness there, heart or solar plexus, 
and find the fire that lives there. And as you breathe your next several breaths, allow that fire to be fed and expanded as you breathe. Intend to hold that fire and bring that fire into the circle with you. So go ahead and use your imagination to come to the very real place that we have created around the fire. See, sense, and imagine everyone here in this circle which is sometimes 10 people, sometimes 100. Coming in from all corners, all places, all spaces, and centering in around the sacred fire that lives in the center. There's a ring of stones that holds the outer circle of the fire. In the fire inside, it burns bright and tall, and it has been well fed and stoked. The fire has set, and the embers, the coals, are thick and full, and that fire is hot. And you can imagine A circle full of healers, creatives, spirit-led people, people in our community here, circling around that fire, breathing in and breathing down. And as the sparks of that fire pop up high into the night, into the sky, Go ahead and find the center of that fire with your awareness. Find the center of that fire. You may see it, sense it, feel it. And from here, find that fire that you were heating up a moment ago. Thank it for living inside of you. Put your hand on your heart to connect with that fire. And we offer gratitude to spirit, creator, life force for feeding and fueling this fire inside of us. Take a moment to send some of that fire into the center fire and see the center fire lighten, grow, pop as everyone around the circle feeds it with their fire. And then think about one thing that you would like to receive or something that you want right now in your life. And go ahead and use your wisdom to reach into that fire, pulsing, strong, burning away illusion and illuminating truth. Go ahead and use your wisdom to go into that fire and gently find what it is you're seeking and bring that energy out and back toward your heart. Breathing in, breathing down, and noticing what it's like to be in a circle of people who are all connected to the fire. The fire in each and every one of us grows and brightens when we come together around the center fire.
take a moment to hold a blessing, a wish, an intention, a prayer that you have right now for yourself. Lift it up in your hands. See it, feel it, hear it, however you experience it. And then go ahead and place that in both hands. Lift your hands up and gently blow it into the fire. All blessings, wishes and prayers in the fire together at once. And you might imagine that the fire grows as it's fed by your prayers. And now imagine a prayer, a blessing, a wish that you have for humanity, for all of humanity, for the heart of humanity. And hold that prayer, wish, and blessing in the palms of your hands. and see, see it in your hands as if it is already done. See the people and the animals and all beings on the planet as they are when they receive that blessing and it is taken hold and rooted inside of them. Their souls have received that blessing. Notice what they look like how they're interacting with one another and how you are interacting with them when your prayer or your wish or your blessing has come to life. Take that energy and take a deep breath and raise your hands and blow it gently and steadily into the center of that fire. Feed the fire with that prayer as if it were already done. We offer gratitude to all of the healing and helping forces, the ones that we know and the ones that are at our backs that we don't know. We offer gratitude to the healing forces that are working for our benefit, for the heart of humanity behind the scenes in the ethers. Thank you, thank you, thank you. for guiding us and guiding this planet to a place of health and respect and equality. Thank you for moving through us and continuing to make yourself known. Thank you for melting obstructions. And thank you for illuminating what is right and true in the hearts of each and every person on this planet. Deep breath in. And out. Again, feeling the heat of your breath as you inhale. And slowly exhale through your mouth. Feeling the heat in your mouth and the heat of your breath as you breathe out. <clears throat> offering your fire to the center fire. And offering gratitude to the fire for carrying your prayer and your blessing and our prayer and our blessing into all of the nooks and the crannies. So that it is so. Breathing in. Breathing down. Bringing your awareness back into your heart. <clears throat> Feeling your toes and your fingers. And gently, when you're ready, opening your eyes. <clears throat> we have an opportunity here. We have many opportunities. We have opportunities to see what's off on the planet and to take action so that we are combining forces with other human beings who are taking action. 
and we can support that action with our prayers and our blessings and working with the energy of the fire. And you can do that with live fire in front of you that you create. You can do that with a candle. <clears throat> you can do that internally and in a meditative space like we just did. We have a grand opportunity when it comes to working with fire. So revisit this meditation <clears throat> and work with this idea and this practice to connect with fire. We need all of us on board and all of us on deck. We need the healers and the energy workers to be at their best and on point for themselves, for yourself, and for what humanity is calling forth from us. We are really just at the beginning of supporting this earth and her people in the way that we're going to need to support the earth and her people. We are just at the beginning. So I recognize this and I've been recognizing it for a long time. It's time for people who have the skills <clears throat> and the knowing and the calling to step up and to step in, to move out of a place of indecisiveness or fear and into a place of power to assist others. There is power and the beautiful flow that comes through us when we're helping others. And when we activate that, more is activated. I am in the process of forming a healers collective to guide healers and way showers into truly taking their work into the world because you're needed. I have a waiting list that I can share with you if you're interested so that you can receive information when it's ready and when I launch it. So I will pop the link in here to get on the waiting list. And if you're interested in being in the waiting list, just write waiting list so I know and make sure that I get that to you. All right, my beautiful friends. Here we are. It's Monday. We've got the fire stoked inside of us. We're connected to the fire in the center. Thank you for joining us. I hope you have a beautiful, beautiful day. Bye for now.